time you are at the gas station, you might hear something unusual. Yeah, some 7-Elevens, some convenience stores across the whole country. Some of them are starting to play opera, some classical music, blaring it outside to deter people from loitering at their business. Well, now we've learned that includes some stores here in Colorado Springs. Our Jessica Grumling is live with us right now. Jess, you're at the 7-Eleven on South Nevada in Cimarron. It's just one store that's blaring this opera music to, again, to deter loitering. Seems to be helping business. Yeah, you can hear it faintly from where I'm standing right now just because of all the traffic, but once you get to the door, it is definitely very loud. This is something that's going on across the country, and the idea is if that the music is annoying enough, people won't want to stick around. The sound of opera music in the morning. It's cool. <laughs> I love opera music. I like it. I don't mind it. Yeah, I think it's kind of nice. Personally, I love classical music, so I'm okay with it. Uh, a lot of other people think it's really weird. What may make it weird is it's playing at this 7-Eleven at South Nevada in Cimarron. And it plays all day. An employee at the store tells me it's used to deter people from hanging out near the front door. She's been working here for the past year and a half and says she thinks it helps. According to the Colorado Springs Police Department, they've been called to this 7-Eleven 219 times in the last year. 58 of those calls have been for trespassing. Now, customers have mixed reviews. No. <laughs> so I do see the homeless around here quite a bit and they don't loiter right here. I see them like they go in and they buy things and then they just kind of move on. It's supposed to be a deterrent for loitering around here. Do you think that helps? Any? And we were interrupted during this interview before the question could be answered. A growing homeless population is an issue another 7-Eleven owner says is affecting not only his business, but the whole state. And they start like asking people for like drinks and food and sandwiches and stuff and a lot of customers they got frustrated like they don't feel safe a lot of people like oh I don't want to come to this location anymore I'd rather take my business somewhere else because I don't feel safe when I see a bunch of homeless people hanging out on the property. Christopher Alaz was attacked by someone he says was homeless while in his store off of I-25 in Uinta this week. He doesn't play classical music at his store right now but is looking for any solution. Yes, definitely. I would consider anything to kind of prevent people like from loitering at my store or at any other location. That will be definitely helpful. But whether the music is helping or not, Allah's believes more needs to be done. I think the mayor, the city council, the police officers, the homeless outreach team have to be more involved with kind of cleaning the city. Allah has added that for his store and others that are more in more residential areas that playing the music could cause issues with neighbors. We did reach out to 7-Eleven corporate for comment on their stores doing this, but haven't heard back. Reporting live in downtown Colorado Springs, Jessica Grundling, KRDO News Channel 13. All right. Thanks a lot, Jess.